Hello everyone, today I'm going to quickly tell you how to get rid of this annoying little icon here that uh, pops up on your Windows 7 or Windows uh, 8 desktop and urges you to upgrade to Windows 10. I'm not going to get into the many reasons why you don't want to get Windows 10. I know many of you did get the update and are very happy with that. Some of you, like me, are not, and they decided to downgrade back to their original Windows 7 operation system. But one thing that will keep bugging them is the fact that you will still get that little thing here saying get Windows 10 all the time. And some of you might say, oh, I can just hide it here and not see it, and that's, that's quite true. The only thing is that this icon is actually a program, a little program that starts with your operation system. So what's the point of, of dedicating resources to something, to a program that constantly runs and you never use? It's, it's like carrying someone else's bag everywhere you go. So I'm going to quickly show you how to get rid of it. It's really easy. Uh, this program was installed with a, with, with a small update for your operation system. So the only thing you need to do is actually click Start and then in the search bar type Windows Update. And once you go to Windows Update, you will have to you have to go to Installed Updates over here, click it, and now just wait until that uh, window here refreshes and you'll get a list of all the installed updates. You see it's starting to populate. Uh, while it's doing this, I'll mention that you will be looking for an update which is called Update for Microsoft Windows KB3035583. So let's see whether this thing populated completely. No, there is still, still some updates to, to show. So there we go, let's, let's search now. We're looking for, as I said, update for Microsoft Windows. Okay. KB3035583. Once again, make sure that this is the update that you select. KB3035583. What you need to do now is right click, uninstall. Are you sure you want to uninstall this update? Yes, I'm actually quite sure. And now just wait until the uninstall is complete. Once this is done, you have to reboot your computer. And I'll show you what to do. There's one more quick step and this little thing here will be gone for good. So there we go now. The update is uninstalled and my computer asks me to restart. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to actually reboot and I'll show you the last step. Alright, so my computer is rebooted now and you can actually see that this annoying message here is gone but don't don't hurry to rejoice just yet because what will happen is during the next windows update uh, microsoft will push that uh, that tiny program again and it will install automatically on your computer so what you have to do now as a final step is go back to windows update click start menu then in the search box type windows update then click on Windows Update and you will be back here again. The one thing you need to do at that point is click Check for Updates. This will take some time. Your computer will check for available Windows Updates and then one that's, once that's done, just click here on the important updates which are available. Once you do that, you will see a list of the available updates and among them you will find the one that we just removed update for Windows 7 KB3035583 now do, th do two things number one remove that check mark here and number two 
right click on it and then click hide update once this is done click OK get out of here and you're free of the annoying bugging message that tells you to get Windows 10 this is it